Hey guys, it's Janiksa and welcome to another nail lacquer therapy session. Hey guys, today we're going to be taking a look at the latest Morgan Taylor collection. This is the A Fuzzy Feeling collection for holiday slash winter 2024. It still feels a little too early for me to be seeing these holiday collections, but spoiler alert, this one is a good one. It is a six piece collection and I got it at, I believe, nailwholesale.com. I will have them linked for you down below. So yeah, six piece collection. Let's go ahead and get right into the swatches. First up, we have Sugar Coated Dreams, and this is a gorgeous red metallic. And you guys, I just love that Morgan Taylor did, you know, these gorgeous metallic y chromey colors. They are so beautiful, and they have such a great formula. This one is a one coater, however, I am going to show you what it looks like in two because I always do that. I just really, really love a manicure in two coats. The formula on this one is beautiful, excellent, very easy to work with, no issues whatsoever. This would look also very gorgeous, mattified. These kinds of shades look stunning mattified. Love it so much. Next up, we have Bring It On, and this one is a gorgeous blue metallic. I love it, you guys. It's beautiful. The formula, again, beautiful one coat formula. I went ahead and did two, and I just, I really, really enjoy this type of formula for the holidays, and yeah, this, this collection did not disappoint whatsoever. You know, this collection actually reminds me of an Essie collection that released I want to say maybe two years ago the J rumor jazz it collection that was only available uh, outside of the US and it had these gorgeous jewel tones and this collection for sure reminds me of that collection and I love it even more for that I did end up getting that collection uh, somebody was so kind and sent it over to me but yeah this is just a beautiful collection this one is called What the Fluff, and this one is more chromey than the other two. The other two, I say, had more of like very, very fine metallic flakes, uh, but this one is definitely more of a chrome. And just, you know, keep in mind, there is going to be some brush strokes here. I really don't mind brush strokes with a manicure. I just think it gives it a little something extra. So yeah, this is absolutely gorgeous. The formula is great and I got coverage in two coats. Next up is You Sweater Believe It, and this one is a silver metallic. This one is a little different than the other two formulas that we've looked at so far. Uh, it's not a chrome, and I feel like the little metallic micro flakes in there are kind of more scattered than you know the other polishes that we've looked at but overall this one had a really nice formula i got opacity in two coats you most definitely will need a second coat with this one i just you know i don't find myself wearing these kinds of silvers for the holidays even though they make a good manicure for i think new year's eve but I just don't find myself wearing them. I feel like they're better for nail art or an accent nail. Let me know. Do you wear silvers like that for a full manicure during the holiday season? Or is that just, you know, a small part of your manicure? Next up here, we have Cuddle Me Tight. And this one, I wouldn't say it's gold. It's hmm, more bronzy copper kind of color, and I was actually surprised by it. I was expecting more of a gold because the promotional pictures for this collection looked, it made it look more gold, but I like that it's this kind of shade because gold is another one of those colors that I really don't wear for a full manicure, so yeah, I like this one. It had a good formula, and I got opacity in two coats. Next up, we have Slaying in Style, and this is a red jelly with some holographic scattered glitter, and it's beautiful. I did two coats for this one, but 
on my swatch photo, you can still see my nail line. So if you want to, you know, fully cover that nail line, you're going to want to go in for a third. But overall, I thought it looked pretty good in two coats on my short nails. I like this one too, but I kind of wish they, they would have just done another metallic or chrome to keep going with the theme of the rest of the collection. But that's just, you know, me being picky because overall it was a good shade and it had a good formula. All right, you guys, there you have it. Swatches of the Morgan Taylor A Fuzzy Feeling Collection for holiday slash winter 2024. What did you think of these polishes? You know, I actually really enjoyed this collection. I feel like Morgan Taylor is a brand that I can just kind of take or leave, but this collection i really liked it it was fun the formulas are amazing and like i said these um, metallic shades look really great with a matte top coat so yeah overall i really enjoyed this collection it was a good one and yeah i'm happy with it let me know in the comments down below what you guys think of this collection and are you thinking like me that it's just way too soon to be looking at christmas collections because it is the end of september i you know, I know that retail just moves pretty quick, but still, I just feel like it's still too early. It was 90 degrees yesterday here in the Midwest, so I'm still not in that holiday, you know, spirit yet, or even fall slash winter. I'm still not there yet. I, I don't know. The weather is supposed to cool down for this week, so maybe I will get there this week. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah guys uh, let me know what you think of this collection in the comments down below and yeah that is it for this video thank you so much for watching please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>